was just telling Kira to get me out of the tree and that I couldn't feel my legs and she knew instantly that something was wrong, like really wrong. <laughs> me and my friend Kira, we woke up and we went to go ride the four-wheeler and she had went around a few times and then it was my turn because we always took turns driving and we went really fast through this field and we got onto this little trail and we hit a bump wrong and it just flipped. I had the four-wheeler behind my back, the handlebars were on my back and I was in a tree shaped like a Y and the Y part was under my arms and my legs, one was out in front of me and one was bent back. I shattered my T12 in my spine, the vertebrae. I had cracked ribs and fluid in my lungs and they had to give me chest tubes. And I broke my left collarbone and my left shoulder blade. Yeah, they told me in ICU that I wouldn't be able to, but I just was like, Mom, I'm going to. Yep. And... Okay, He's wait. tired. Are you tired? Kind of. Are you sit or are you good? Gotta shake it out. Okay. I was in the children's hospital for three or four days. And then June 8th, I went to the children's center, and I left the children's center July 29th. I usually just kind of sit and watch them practice and I help out the coaches and I help out the teammates and stuff, but they help me out too. So I've been to cross country meets. I did the whole cross country season in the summer and part of it in school. I have feeling, complete feeling to like here on my thighs, but it gets harder and harder to feel as I go down. Well, I remember my very first physical therapy, they just raised me up in bed and that was horrible just because I had gotten out of surgery and stuff for my back. And I had to relearn how to sit up straight. Um, I can raise my legs. Um, recently, I've gotten muscle spasms in my toes, so that's good. I want to be a nurse at the Children's Center.